Alright guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So for today we have a Mortal Kombat 11 video in which we're gonna try to answer if MK11 is truly the worst Mortal Kombat game out there. So before I get into any of that, if you're a part of the Mortal Kombat fan base, be sure to smash that subscribe button. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so I'm sure a lot of you have heard people online saying that MK11 is trash and that MKX is way better and things like that. And we're gonna try to see just how true that is. So to start things off, I want to say that I'm not going to be focusing on other aspects of Mortal Kombat 11 such as the crypt or skins or gear because in that sense it's really good but I'm just going to be looking at the actual fighting of Mortal Kombat 11 like the fighting mechanics and how you play the game. So um, like I said, a lot of you have heard people saying that MK11 is trash and I'm not going to lie, it does like I, the people that are saying that kind of have a reason and I'm going to tell you why right now. So, Mortal Kombat X, Mortal Kombat 9, Mortal Kombat Armageddon, and Deception all won fighting game of the year in the years that they came out in, right? Now, Mortal Kombat 11 is the first Mortal Kombat game in like 10 or more years to not win fighting game of the year. Now, that alone says a lot about MK11. And on top of that, the main way you play MK11, like the actual fighting mechanics and the way you get combos, it's all like footsie based and little pokes that lower your opponent's health which is not fun in any way and to add on the the Mortal Kombat 11 combos are all based off crushing blows if you don't get a crushing blow you don't get any good combos and the worst thing about crushing blows is that you can only do one of each crushing blow per match and on top of that the crushing blows, a lot of them are super specific and hard to actually accomplish. For example, the one that, that triggers with an uppercut, you need to hope that your opponent hits you, misses you, and that you get the punish with an uppercut right after your opponent misses his attack. Now that's how that crushing blow works. Like, like why is it so specific, guys? I, I don't know. I don't think that's, that's a good way to have a fighting game work. And on top of that, the meters in MK11 suck. They just refill automatically. So you could just sit there spamming and you're like sit in the back spamming and your meters will be refilling as you spam against your opponent, which like I say, guys, is not any way to play a fighting game. And then the last thing is the fatal blow or, or the super move. That's what I call it. So for your super move, your health just needs to be low. Now, why would someone that's losing be rewarded with a super move it's like hey you're losing and you suck at the game boom here you go here's a super move like i don't know guys there's just so many things about mortal kombat 11 that i don't like the main thing is actually the meter thing like i i like a game that you have to work to get your meter for that way it, it's actually skill that you need and not just spamming in the back waiting for your meter to get filled and honestly i'm not trying to make this like a rant video on mk11 but I'm just saying that yes, MKX and even MK9, in my opinion, are all way better than Mortal Kombat 11 for quite a few reasons. The combos are better in MKX and in MK9, the mechanics all better, the way you fight, the smoothness of the game. I'm pretty sure a lot of you will agree with me in saying that at least MKX 100% better than MK11. But for me, if they were to ask me, hey, you can only play one of these Mortal Kombat games for the rest of your life. MK11 or MK9, hands down, I would say MK9. But enough of that, guys. What I want to know is what do you guys think in the comment section down below. Do you think MK11 is good or do you think MKX and MK9 both beat it? So, really quick, guys, I'm not trying to like spike any hate or anything like that. Obviously, we're all going to have different opinions, but those are just my opinions and the reasons why I don't really play MK11 that much. So like I said, leave your opinions and comments in the comment section down below. Be sure to stay subscribed for more videos just like this and peace.